Hey guys, so have you ever been wondering what kind of high-end preamps that you might wanna use on your drums? Well, today I thought I might do a little bit of a shootout for you. So I've got, uh, as you can see here, I've got four microphones set up on my snare top. These are all Sennheiser's E604s. I'm gonna be running these through four different preamps just so you can hear a comparison of how they're gonna sound. I'm gonna use the preamp on my Mo2 8 Pre, that's gonna be kind of, uh, I guess you could say like the placebo um, preamp. You know, it's gonna be kind of the, the very basic, nothing fancy, very, um, very dry sort of preamp. And then we can kind of compare all the other preamps against that one. So what else am I gonna be recording into besides the, the, the Mo2 preamp? I got a Universal Audio 610. This is a, a tube-based preamp. Um, it also has an EQ section on it, but we're going to be leaving the EQ flat. I just want to focus on just the preamp sound for this video. Um, next up, we're going to be running this through an API. This is a 3124 Plus. Uh, they have newer models of this, but it's basically the same exact sound. Um, the APIs are very um, well known, uh, especially for drums, you know, kind of like a heavier rock sound. Um, so it'll be interesting to see how that that mic preamp which is a solid state how that compares to the 610 which is like i said a tube preamp uh, and then i also have a a designs pacifica uh, this is also a solid state preamp um, it has a little bit of the same characteristics of as the api in a sense but the the pacifica is very um it's, it's a little bit more of a kind of laid back. The API can be, if you, especially if you push, it can be very much more in your face. So I'm gonna start off playing with the snares off. On the playback, you'll hear me switching between the different mic preamps from, you know, by switching the different mic inputs. Um, I'll have some text on the screen so you know which one that is being played back. Then I'll throw the snares on play on the, the snare a little bit like that. And then I'll start to throw in the bass drum and the overheads into the mix. So you can kind of see how the sound plays in with the overall mix. So I hope you guys found that useful. I know when I was first building out my studio, I had no idea how these different preamps sounded. Um, and so I had to read a ton of reviews and make some guesses and, and hope a little bit that I was getting 
uh, products that I was going to really uh, enjoy using in the studio. So I hope that uh, being able to hear these comparisons will help you make uh, better decisions for yourself. If there's some other preamp that you love using on the snare or even on some on the toms or on the bass drum, you know, I'd love to know about it. So let me know in the comments below. Um, and if you want to see more videos like this in the future, then don't forget to subscribe.